Hey guys, welcome to my bathroom. I'm just back from work, super tired. And I thought I'd walk you through my winter skincare routine for the evenings. Now, um, I have simplified my routine quite a lot, but just wanted to talk you through the thought process behind it. So first thing that I have is when I come back from work, I have this very shiny forehead. I usually have no makeup on my forehead, it's just a primer. Then I have a little bit of makeup. By, by the time I arrive, it's been completely worn out. So I'm going to go now into my, me my medicine cabinet and then get the products that I use for the night. I have a first cleanse, because I always double cleanse. And then I have my second cleanse. And I like to use um, one of these um, uh, uh, loofahs. It's not loofahs, what are they called? Cloth? Yeah, cloth. And this mm, eye cream. This is actually it for now. Okay. First step for me is removing makeup and grime. I'm using this cleanser from Vanilla Co. I've had it for a while, and so I'm just going to have a little bit of that. Grab a bit with a spatula, and then just work it on my face so that I melt off the makeup. This is meant to remove all the, that top layer, so I don't necessarily go for a cleanser that I would enjoy using. This one has a slight um, almost like a fake, fake floral sweet scent. I don't mind it, and so I will go all over my face. I try not to forget my ears, around my ears, around the hairline, and I don't do much around the eyes because these days I haven't really been wearing uh, a lot of eye makeup. I just don't have the time. And then I go over my mouth. This is also the time that I use to just have a sort of quick massage but I will do the more in-depth massage when I do the, the, the proper cleanser. This is just melting off all of that surface stuff. I will add some warm water and then emulsify this and then go over this thing. Right now it's white. Once I go over the, the, the makeup, it's going to be completely brown, even if I rinse it. I have now done the first layer um, with this Clean It Zero by Vanilla Co. It is one of the best selling products in those K-Beauty, J-Beauty websites. I personally don't like it. The only reason I'm using it is because I've had it for a long, long time. And so I'm gonna use it up so that I don't have to toss it. Um, I I much much prefer the Clinique Take the Day Off Balm. I think that this one uh, is a bit greasy on the skin. It's very difficult to remove. Once you add water, it does not emulsify. And I have to use my loof, my little cloth, which now is completely uh, dirty. But I just feel like there is a lot of rubbing action that is happening on my skin before the makeup is removed whereas when I use Clinique Take the Day Off Balm it's much easier when I use a uh, cleansing oil it's much easier now the only upside that I can see is that it does not dry out my skin but even that I'm not really sure because I'm thinking maybe it just leaves a residue that, that I'm not able to clean my second cleanse is the Moringa Cleansing Balm by Emma Hardy this is the big tub and I've had it for several months and I've been using it for several months because you really need the tiniest, tiniest bit. This is all I'm going to use for my face. And that's because it's really, let me close this because I don't want to spill it. It's an expensive product. Uh, I used to have the, the travel size ones and I've had it two or three times in one of those subscription boxes and I loved it so much. I'm not wasting any bit. I loved it so much that I was really torn about buying it and then one day I eventually bought it because it, there was an offer on it on one of those websites. Not much reduction but still and I think it is one of the best cleansers. I only save it for, I save it only for second cleanse because it's expensive, it's luxurious. I like the smell of it, it's a bit strong for my liking, too florally but I can live with that. 
So now I have put it all over my face. I will just massage a little bit. Not too long, just a minute. And go behind my ears. I don't have any makeup there, but I like to go all over. And now I will take that same uh, little mitt from Sarah Chapman. Now I'm gonna use the soft one because this bit was already rough and um, I had to be a little bit rough with my skin when trying to remove makeup because that cleanser is not good. So now I'm using the soft one because I already know this cleanser is really amazing. So I don't need to rub or anything. I'm just going to have hot water, uh, massage it all over my skin, rinse and repeat. So it's pretty luxurious. Now my skin not only feels clean, it feels very soft. You can see a bit of the texture and that's part of why I have simplified my skincare because I feel that my skin is going through it all with winter. It's just been very cold and I feel that I just don't want to put much on my skin at this point. I'm going with an eye cream. This is still the Innisfree White Tone Up Eye Serum. Uh, it comes in an airless pump like that. I use less than a pump for my all over the eye area. I can use my index finger because I know not to put pressure. Some people say you need to use your fin ring finger because that's your weakest, but uh, I'm a pretty uh, controlled person, so I can actually adjust the intensity of the tapping. <sighs> cool. The biggest change in my routine is that now it's been about uh, three or four days uh, that I've done this change and this is why I wanted to even film my routine. So right now I'm using 100% plant derived squalane um, from The Ordinary and it's very very low viscosity so if you look at it it's just it's it almost feels like water I put two drops on each side and as I said very low viscosity so you have to work quick otherwise it's going to drip all over your clothes and I just massage it all over my skin this feels like a very 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 light oil so I don't know how to explain it but you can tell it is an oil because it is relatively slippery but at the same time it has such low Weight because it feels almost like uh, like water. I massage it all over. I feel that it doesn't grease up my skin. Although right now you can see that my skin is pretty shiny, and I have been using this as my moisturizer at night, but I've also been using it as my moisturizer in the morning. And it's actually safe to use on my lips. If I don't feel like having an eye cream, that's something that I would put in in lieu of my eye cream. I think it's such a simple thing because now um, I'm thinking that if I am on a project, let's say, and I have to travel, this is the only moisturizing that I actually need. Morning and night, face, eyes and lips, and I'm actually done. And makeup sits beautifully on top of that. So, next time that I have a travel bag, it's going to have just this in it. For now, I'm obviously still trying to finish quite a few products and there might be a time where I just get bored of using just this very simple thing. So for now, I'm using it whenever I can, but ideally, when I finish all my samples, I will take the decision whether or not I want to just keep purchasing this as my only moisturizer. I think it would simplify my life. i just leave it at this. Otherwise, if I feel like I have uh, blemishes or something like that, I might have a serum before that, which would be my active. Right now, for the rest of the next few weeks, so until the beginning of March, this is the only thing I'm going, I'm going to be using morning and night, just to give my skin a bit of a break, because I feel that every time I go out, I just come back with it a bit um, irritated. I tend to oscillate between having many things for my skincare or just the bare minimum. And right now I'm going through that minimal phase. So I'll go through it for a few weeks and then when I get bored of it or when I start having different needs, like if I get hyperpigmentation more than what I have here, 
or if the unevenness in my skin starts to bother me then I'm going to start adding perhaps acid or, thing, or things like that but for now I just I'm so tired so busy that this routine just works so we keep it at that I'll see you very soon on my channel take care mm -hmm.